Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this is Dead Carpet Energy Drink Reviews, and it's 4.33 p.m., and it's Wednesday, October 6, 2021. Today is my birthday, and I turned 27 years old, so, oh yeah, boys, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. But, um, anyway, I changed shirts because, um, I got a special shirt in the mail, um, a few days ago. I got my package finally in from emotionalapparel.com. Um, I won one of their giveaways on Instagram, so they sent me a shirt. They sent me, like, a tote bag and a, um, quilt thing. And also a magazine, like an aesthetic magazine, you know. But yeah, I'm wearing the shirt today because I wanted to wear it, you know. But yeah, it's very aesthetic looking, you know. It says, no one realizes that I'm crying. Or, wait, I think that's what it is. Yeah, I hope no one realizes that I'm crying. That's what it says. So, oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Has like one of those like Greek statue things and like some 3D eyes and like the, you know, the checkerboard. Like, um like symbol like pattern you know very you know like masonic or like illuminati you know just saying so oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah um but um anyway today i'm gonna be reviewing an interesting energy drink it's brand new i got the akins natural market in bixby it was actually on sale it was like a dollar 69 so oh yeah boys oh yeah oh yeah but um anyway they had three flavors so i got all three to review so yeah but um anyway today i'm gonna be reviewing the mango oka plant-based energy drink so, oh yeah, boys, oh yeah, look at that can, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Very interesting sounding, so oh yeah, oh yeah. Anyway, it has a silver top with a silver tab. Bombs the Best Buy date and production code, Best Buy June 24th, 2022. So it's still fresh for a while. That's the same day, day I uploaded my, um, You're Gonna Be Famous video on my Instagram. So, you know, but that was this year, though, but you know what I mean? But, um, anyway, it says Mango Oka Plant-Based Energy Drink, USA Organic, 12 fluid ounces, 355 milliliters. Shows, like, um, looks like, a, like, tree leaves and, like, um, different color, like, leaves and branches and stuff. The logo looks pretty interesting. Definitely plant-based, I guess. But, yeah. Uh, on the side it says, to-do beam. It means it's all good. We are as we are made. Straight from the Amazon rainforest. We bring you an all-natural energy drink powered by cassava root. That's an interesting ingredient. The cassava root extract, which is tapioca. So, oh yeah, boys, oh yeah, this might be an interesting energy drink. It has tapioca in it. Uh, it says, an all-natural source of energy that keeps you moving to your rhythm all day long. Enjoy Oka for that kind of good energy, the way nature intended. Powered by cassava root extract, tapioca. 120 milligrams natural caffeine, one cup of coffee. Long-lasting energy with no crash or jitters. Hashtag WBM, we believe Magnus. Has some other code and like the crown logo and shows some more like plant leaves and stuff. On top it shows like fruits and stuff. I guess it's like a mango because this one's the mango one. So oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. And he has 120 milligrams caffeine. So oh yeah, boys, it will get lit, you know, just saying. So oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. But anyway, it says it's kosher, allergen free, vegan, naturally sweetened, no added colors, no preservatives, no high fructose corn syrup. Non-GMO Project Verified, nongmoproject.org. I recommend it for children, pregnant, or nursing women, or people sensitive to caffeine. Nutrition facts, one serving container, serving size 12 fluid ounces, 355 milliliters. Amount per serving calories, 60, total fat, 0 grams, 0%, sodium, 15 milligrams, 1%. Total carbohydrates, 15 grams, 5%, dietary fiber, 0 grams, 0%, total sugars, 9 grams. Includes 9 grams added sugars, 18%, protein, 0 grams. Then it has the other ingredients. It has sparkling water, organic tapioca syrup. Organic agave syrup, organic gum acacia, citric acid, organic mango flavor, organic caffeine from green coffee, and organic stevia. Preferably consume after opened, lot and best before, see bottom of the can. Manufactured in Mexico for Believe LLC, www.b-liv.com. Certified organic by Bio AgriCert, SRL, MX Bio 132T08J. Info at bioagricert.org. We'd love to hear from you. It has a QR code you can scan. It probably takes you to their website. 
has some recycling stuff in the SKU, drinkoka.com, Instagram at drink underscore oka, Facebook at drink oka, sway, samba, and enjoy, and it shows to shake it, you know, because yeah, it has the natural ingredients, you know, might settle, you know, just saying, but yeah, that's pretty much the entire can, so anyway, I'll let you see it right quick. Not a lot of stuff on the can. Very minimalistic design, you know. I like the color of the can too. It's like a sort of like a beige or like like a light brown, maybe. I don't know. It's a little bit white though, but yeah, it's like a light brown. A little bit like a um, those khaki pants colored, you know. It's like that. It's got hair on it. Okay. Yeah, it's definitely looks like a natural energy drink. Has like those natural like colors, you know, on the can. Like the light brown and stuff. There's the other code, I don't know if you can really see it. It's like printed messed up. Crown logo. SKU Okay, now for the nutrition facts The other ingredients rest of the can. Okay, that's pretty much the entire can, so I'm going to shake it up a little bit, open it, taste it, and give them a review for it, so hold on a minute. Ooh. Yeah, you might not want to shake it up too much, though, even though you're supposed to shake it up a little bit, because, yeah, it's definitely a little bit um, carbonated. Definitely looks a little bit like one of those sparkling waters or something. Definitely bubbly of the color of the liquid's clear and artificial colors. Definitely bubbly and carbonated, see what I mean? But um, anyway, the scent. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Has a very strong, pungent, natural mango scent. A little bit earthy, but not too much. Um, definitely a very strong mango, like really mango. Definitely very similar to like the Nitro Mango Nos or the... um. A little bit like the Yellow Edition Red Bull, even though that one was like passion fruit, but um, might smell like original Noss a little bit, but um, yeah, like the um, the Swirly Pop Bang Energy Drink, or the um, it smells like another energy drink I've had recently. Yeah, a little bit like the Pineapple Splash, um, Emerge. One definitely smells very mango though, like really mango. It smells a little bit like the pineapple, um, the orange pineapple coconut, I think, um, the Mountain Dew Kickstart, it's a little bit like that. Definitely has a tropical citrusy smell. Very mango though, but um, anyway, I'm now gonna try it, so here goes. Oh yeah, boys, oh yeah. Oh yeah, ooh, well, the aftertaste. Well, well. Sweet mango at first. But yeah, um, you might not want to take a big sip of this because you get hit with a strong, a little bit of an earthy mango aftertaste. Very strong, natural, earthy mango. A little bitter. Um, definitely tart and tangy. But yeah, it just tastes like a, a little bit like a sparkling mango drink at first. It's sweet, but yeah, then it hits you with that strong, natural, earthy aftertaste. So yeah, the aftertaste is like, um, it's a little weird, you know, just saying. Definitely strong. 
And yeah, the aftertaste isn't good, but um, the first part of the taste is like really good. Definitely a strong sweet mango, but um, yeah, the aftertaste though is a no, a no. It's like right after you swallow it, and the flavor is still in your mouth or whatever. It's tasting like an earthy mango. Not too carbonated, pretty smooth. A little bit like the Mountain Dew Kickstarts, and on the top is like Mountain Dew Kickstarts too. Um, but yeah, um, texture wise, it's very similar to the Mountain Dew Kickstarts. A little bit like a sparkling juice type of drink. Um, but this doesn't have any juice in it though. Um, so yeah, but um, it has a natural mango flavor with the stevia extract and stuff. And sweet and strong at first. Yeah, but the aftertaste, definitely strong, very strong, earthy mango flavor. I don't really like the aftertaste, but I like the first part of the drink though. Um, before I swallow it, you know, and then it gets hit with the aftertaste, you know. Um, at first, that was pretty good, but um, yeah, not at the, the aftertaste part, see what I mean? Um, but yeah, it has a cool can design, I like the colors of it and stuff. Energy wise, it has 120 milligrams caffeine, so oh yeah, boys, it'll still get you lit, you know, so oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I'd say energy wise, it doesn't have any B vitamins or anything, just the caffeine. So say energy wise, it probably lasts about two and a half hours, about three and a half hours of energy. So oh yeah, boys, it will get you lit, you know. So oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Like the design of the can, very minimalistic, you know, very earthy toned and stuff. Um, yeah, very nature or natural looking. Yeah, it's definitely healthier for you than compared to like other energy drinks. But um, but the flavor though, the flavor. Good and sweet at first, but then strong, tangy, and earthy at an aftertaste, so yeah, I don't like the aftertaste, but um, the beginning part of the drink I like, so I like it, but I don't like it, so it's interesting. But yeah, it's on sale because it's brand new. I had the Aikens Natural Market, it was $1.69, but um, before it was on sale, it was like around two sixty nine, so I got it for about a dollar less, you know, but um. So it's okay price too, but um, I don't know. I like it at first, but yeah, I don't really like the aftertaste, not at all. I think I'm going to give the Mango Oka plant-based energy drink, I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10. So, oh yeah, boys, it's still lit. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, I give it an 8 out of 10, oh yeah. Energy-wise, it works really good. It has a cool can design. It's cheap. Um... The flavor though, good at first, but then earthy and strong in the aftertaste. Um, but yeah, if you like mango, you'll probably like this, but um, I don't really like earthy flavored drinks, you know, but um, this one though, definitely earthy in the aftertaste, so it's not that good, but um, yeah, it's still good at first though, so yeah, I still think it's okay, so yeah, I'm gonna give it an 8 out of 10. So, oh yeah, boys, it's still lit, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, I give it an 8 out of 10, oh yeah. Anyway, my next two reviews are going to be two more Oka energy drinks. Stay tuned for those reviews. So, no more outcome reviews, some more videos. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace out. And bye.